I'm Yen. I'm Fiona. And we are back with our monthly product showdown. Yay! If you like the video, remember to hit the subscribe button. And um, follow us. <laughs> <laughs> and the bell notification. Yes, notification. Oh my god. And let's go straight into this month's video. I got one more time, noise very bad. Okay. Three, two, one. And we are back for this one! Yay! I'm excited. What do you have for <laughs> I'm us? I'm excited for every episode. Yeah, I'm excited for every episode because I always have something new to share, you see. I'm sure you have as well. Yep, so yep. shall we begin with you? Yes. Okay. What's the goodie? This okay, month? so this month is really a mixed bag of things. Lah. I mean, that isn't really a theme. But okay. um, I have to say, so the first one is it's a new product. I've never used it. Mm, okay. um, I'm not... <laughs> I, I don't use this product on a regular basis. Okay. Um, but I made it on your list this yeah. month, so... Um, I only use it when I'm given it for free, to be very honest. <laughs> so um, I'm guessing it's expensive? It's just that I, I don't have that habit of using it. <gasps> okay. I actually bought it once, mm. because that particular th that particular brand, I really like it. But okay. this time around, I got it for free. I mean, to be very honest, okay. I didn't buy it. But okay. I really love it. Okay. Yeah. So it's... Dish it out, dish it out. <laughs> So it's actually a fragrance. Yay! Yeah, actually I don't buy fragrance to yeah, be honest. You don't. The yeah. only fragrance um I bought right mm. was a Dior fragrance, which I okay. really love it. Okay. Um so I got this uh from Esoap, thanks a lot. And I have to say, right, uh we went to the event together yeah. and I really, really, really love this scent. Uh, because it's what I really love, the musky, you know, that sort Indy of woody scent. scent. Mm. Yeah. Uh, so they just launched a trail of scent and this one of them is called, um, the pronunciation is really a challenge, it's called Mirasetti, if I pronounce it correctly. Okay, so this is uh, Ori Parfum. It really lasted almost the whole day wow. for me till now. So, um, okay, if you are a fan of Scent that's woody, mm. musky, yeah, with a tone of, um, you know, something that's this very earthy tone to it. It's probably one of my favorites when it comes to uh, fragrances and scent. Oh my god, I must say that this mm. is a very, very sexy and sensual. Okay, sensual scent. Maybe not a sexy scent. It's mm. a very sensual scent. Yes. Um. Okay. One. I think one thing about Yisoap is that you know a lot of fragrances, right? They're always like male fragrances, female yeah. fragrances. But um, you do realize that Yisoap fragrances there is an indication no. of gender. No. As long as you love the scent, yeah. you don't have to be categorized according to oh you know I'm selling you a ladies yeah. fragrance kind of thing. Yeah. I recall when we went to the event, right, when mm. they were asking us like um what scent would we typically go for. Yep. So I think um you went for the woody um mm. and musky scent and yep. then when it came to my turn, I also asked for the same thing as well. Yep. So I think even between the two of us, I think we, we gravitate towards um very woody as well as musky scent, which mm. like I said, it's very sensual and yes. it, it feels very, very personal. Yep. This is a good one, this yes. one. So yeah. I would say if you're a fan of such scent, uh do give it a try, you know, give, um go to the ESO. Uh, stalls and I'm very sure the people there will be more than happy to let you try this new scent. Okay, I don't have scent, but this is what I would do, okay? I'm gonna talk about this too. And because we did an episode last video uh, on foundation. Right. So this month I'm gonna talk about these two products and it has to come in two. Uh, there's a reason do why. Do they sell in a pair? Or no, they don't, they don't sell in a pair, but there's a reason why I put them together. Okay, okay. so I am gonna put forth these two products. Um, this is a NAS Soft Matte Foundation and this is I think one of their ra Radiant Glow um, kind of foundation as well. So these two products um, are my favorite this month and there's a reason why I kind of put them together. Mm. You can try this one, okay. Mm. So, um, the good people at NAS actually sent me some products and interestingly, uh, I have not actually tried their base product except for the concealer. If you are looking for something that um, you want to look radiant, um, this is the one that you need to go for, okay. So, I use this actually only at the top part, um, the, the cheekbones, the bridge of my nose, as well as a little bit on my forehead. So, only on this area uh, after the, um, what do you call it, after sunscreen and then after which I put this on. Uh, which is the soft matte foundation. Now, what I really like about the combination of this two is the soft matte foundation itself already has that like filtered kind of effect. So it really helps to minimize your pores. But because on top of that filtered look, right, I like to have a little bit of that, you know, when light 
shines on certain parts of your face it bounces off so it looks like you know you just like had a lot of collagen going on in your face mm. so this is the one that i would top it up with so this is not a foundation well you can use it as a foundation okay. um but the reason why your friend here doesn't use it as foundation because she has a little bit of her pigmentation going on so okay. i need a little bit of help uh with a uh, long wear Right. Uh, foundation as well so yeah i combine this two together so it gives a very very nice sheen to your face mm. shine but it's not oily shiny if you know what i mean okay, so now it's my turn for my second product okay yes. i can safely say right my next two products you'll mm. definitely want to buy them oh my god okay now you're making me very excited <gasps> okay the second product is actually um medicube <gasps> lifting peptide um eye cream Okay, so what happened was that I was using retinol for a while, as you know. I know. Yeah, so it really got um, my eye, under eye to be quite dry. Mm. Uh, with the eye cream, I think after three days, four days, oh. mm, it really lightened um, the lines quite a fair bit. Okay. And it really moisturized the eye area quite well. I just tried this texture. I must say it absorbs really quickly and it's very light. It's like a gel-like texture. Very balmy, yeah. very light. Actually, no smell, which is great. Mm. Yeah. Actually, to be honest, right, it's such a huge tube, right? A little goes a long way, I think. It's 30 ml, right? It's a regular size serum. It's like a 30 ml. Yeah, yeah, so you're for right. a 30 ml tube, right? You could easily use it as a serum for the whole face. I'm, I'm sold. Oh my god, this is way too early in the game to say I'm sold. But <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah. Now I know why you say this is kind of my thing. Yes. Leading up to what you just mentioned in a tube form, mm. I'm gonna talk about something also in a tube. Okay. And you know what is really interesting about what you said? is because that makes us beauty and the gig. Mm -hmm. That makes us a duo because the next thing I want to talk about... Is it the same about, product? No, it's not the same product, but it comes in a tube and oh, I it's have... the same. Yeah, except the price point is not the same. Um, so this is by... Um, Polar cute. Cosmetics. So it's oh. called Wrinkle Shot. Okay, so, so if you... Take a look, right? Like, it's really indented already. Lah. So you can tell that this is a very, very well-loved mm. product for the last one month or so. In fact, I think I've used this for two months already. But I didn't recommend it in the previous video because I really wanted to try it um, a lot longer. Um, so I can share with you guys a little bit more. Two months ago, when I visited my dermatologist, right? I think I told you about it. So mm. basically, it's just to do the, the usual lasers for the face, uh, for my pigmentation. And then he went, oh, you know, you might want to moisturize your forehead a little bit more. I got this product and I decided mm. that I'm going to give this a shot, focusing on my, no pun intended, give it a shot, focusing on my forehead, uh, laugh lines, as well as um, neck area, which is clearly an area that will show aging quite easily. Mm. A month later, so I use this religiously every night, huh? every single night for one month. So one month later, I went back and then after that, the derm was doing his thing, right? And I was like, Oh, you know, do you think I need to do something extra for my forehead? Because he talked about it last month, right? And then he went, no, no, no. I think whatever you're doing now, it's good. It's looking good. Whatever you're moisturizing, you're doing now, just keep it as it is. Oh, this is the one. Uh, wrinkle shot. Yep. So that's my second one. Okay. So we are down to the last product. <laughs> I feel like the last product, right? every month would be the highlight that we're going in for the battle. Yeah. So please do not disappoint me, okay? Let's go for okay? the kill one. Yes, because mine is going to be a killer. Let's just put it this okay. way. I feel this one, I, I show win one. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, let's see. I've tried first generation. Oh. Oh. So now they're out of the second generation. What's that? And it's, it's good one. <laughs> That's all I can say. Okay, actually I just received it like really literally before filming like 15 minutes before filming this. Drum roll! So this is... What's that? <gasps> oh my god! Okay, so this brand is IDS. Uh, IDS is um, a laser clinic. We go yeah. to the laser clinic. Um, yeah. But we are not promoting for the laser clinic. Try Crystal Tomato. Mm. Uh, Crystal Tomato is another whitening pill. Uh, yeah. It's kind of like antioxidant so yeah. and so forth. Uh, it's a patented ingredient as in that Crystal Tomato. is white tomato uh, lycopene. Uh, so for IDS, they also start working and researching on their whitening uh, pill as well, which mm -hmm. is called Lyco White Ultra. Mm -hmm. um, this is the second generation. So the first generation, it did contain uh, the lycopene for, from white tomato. Okay. Uh, likewise, for this one, they also contain it as well. But the difference for the second generation is that um, they added this very powerful antioxidant. It's called Pycnogenol. It's yeah. actually pine, pine tree bark yes. extract. 
So I've been taking pine tree bark extract since secondary school. For the longest time, for he's longest been time, like yeah. an ambassador for, for that pine tree, pine tree. Yeah. Yeah, so the, the story behind this pine tree bark is that when I was young, right, I was reading Elle magazine. So oh. back then, right, they have this little column mm. on how Hollywood select preserve mm. their youth. Mm. Then they start talking about Pink Nogino. Mm. I was like, what the hell is that? I want to be like that. Like 16. <laughs> so I went to find and I yeah. bought it. Okay. Um, so in fact, some um, hospitals, right, they actually get their cancer patients to take Pink Nogino. You know, oh, really? as a post treatment uh, uh maintenance. Okay, so it helps I suppose cell renewal mm, in that yeah. sense. So right? it improves okay. immunity, right. antioxidants. So this new generation or the second gen of like whole white right, mm -hmm. uh to me it's like okay, it's really a uh, one stone Q2 bird. Okay. Because I've been taking pine bark okay. extract yeah. and I thought that hey might as well just buy it. Yeah. Uh and great is that they have this 30% for their first Pioneer Why didn't order. you tell hey, me? I thought you received the EDM because probably they sent to everyone in their database. Okay, maybe I never checked. Yeah, so one shot I bought three boxes. Damn, that's such a good deal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's actually quite a good deal. So after, okay, before that it's 130 for one month's okay, supply. Okay. After that it's 90 something. So you take this every day? Just one a day would do. Okay, so so what mm. are you ex what are the kind of results you're expecting to see? Okay, see, I've tried Crystal Tomato, yeah. which is the brand mm. that uh, initiate this whole whitening mm. thing. Mm. Uh, I've tried IDS version. To be mm. honest, I find that um, the very first thing that I observe right, is hydration level oh, of the skin wow. and the clarity of the skin. Okay. If you were to ask me, did my skin really turn fairer? Mm. I, I wouldn't use the word fairer, but mm. I feel that definitely the clarity is there. Okay. So, you know, sometimes we have all this, um, yeah. you know, as we age, right? Mm. All this acne scars, oh. right? Yeah. They take forever to Yeah, to I have one here. Yeah, but they are God. not pigmentation. They are just acne scars. Yeah, it just scarring. refuses to go away. Super good for such things. If you are sold in terms of what Yen has to say, by the way, we're not selling any of this. You mm. know, sold in that sense. Yep. Um, what I'm going to share with you, I think com uh, combined with, you know, what you're going to put into your but body and, topic <laughs> and topical <laughs> application, I think it's going to work really well. Yeah. But Ness, I'm going to leave it for another episode, okay? okay. That I'm... Yeah, trying. But anyway, this one. Okay, mm. it's a topical product. And what it claims to do is... I mean, just the name itself. Oh, Jin. Uh -huh. Such a cute name. I know, right? Okay, we're going to do a close-up later in a bit. Mm -hmm. So this is um, a brand that's called um, A Gel Cosmetics something. ACP. Okay, it's ACP. I'm going to... Yeah, we're going to put that in later. Oh, yeah. Okay. ACP Tokyo. Yeah, so this is a Japanese brand. So what this product claims it is... Uh, uh, it's probably about close to 90% of natural ingredients where the main bulk of the ingredients, it's uh, this Japanese plant extract. If I recall, it's Chardonnay, which sounds like the white wine. Um, so this particular plant extract uh, mm. actually helps you to sort of regenerate your cell and if you're using this when you don't have enough sleep you will wake up the next morning that's the claim lah you wake up the next morning looking like you had 10 hours of sleep therefore oh. it's called clock G right so it's kind of like turning back the clock what it has done for me is I'm not so sure whether genetically my cell has like you know kind of reversed that clock uh, but I do see that my skin doesn't look tired when I wake up in the morning when I use this. And I like it because it's also 90% um, natural ingredients. Um, yeah, so if you are battling with like, let's say, you know, sensitivity and you're looking for some kind of a clean product, uh, well, this is not 100%, but it's 90 So this would be a good one to go for. Okay, so now, if you were to buy one product here, at, at, apart from your own product, yes. choose one, which means only three here. You know which I'm gonna go for la. The pills la. Yes, I'm gonna go for the pills because I think you know um you papa, <laughs> Yeah, this this is this is this is really a good one because um you've been talking about this this um uh, crystal, crystal tomato for yeah. the longest time and you know I've been battling pigmentation and melasma. So I think this would definitely help to maintain uh whatever good work I've been doing so far for the pigmentation. So this would be my pick this yep. month. Okay. What about yours? Any? Like you can pick your own lah. I'll pick this eh. Ooh. To be honest, right? I was quite surprised that it's a very sheer yes. coverage. So to be honest, to me it doesn't feel like foundation. It right. just feels like it adds the glow to your skin. Yeah. So I feel that it's good for those who naturally have nice skin, mm. but probably dull. Mm. 
Uh oh, not me. That means in, ter- in terms of texture, <laughs> it's, yeah. it's all right. Yeah. They have very smooth texture, yeah. but you don't have that glow. Yes. So this one is like, uh, uh, you can zing your skin with this one. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So this is our uh, monthly recommended products for this month. I hope that there's something for you to try. Uh, if there's anything, any comment, you can just leave a comment yes. down below and we will see you next month. Take care. Bye-bye.